do you want to be able to take prepayments for promotions or ticket events? Res Diary has the capability to support this. This tutorial will cover each step of this process. Before you start this tutorial, it's important to make sure your payments are secure. If you will take bookings through your business website, you need to make sure it has a valid SSL certificate so that you can protect your customer's card details. If you do, it will read HTTPS in the address bar. If not, there are full details on how to obtain an SSL certificate in the video descriptor. If you're taking bookings through a booking button to resdiary.com, you're already secure. You'll also need to make sure you have a Stripe account connected to your diary. There are full details on how to do this in a separate film that is linked in the video descriptor. First, you'll need to create a promotion for the event or promotion you want to take payments for. If you haven't done this before, there are full details of how to do this in the Create a Basic Promotion film, which is linked in the descriptor. Now you can create the deposit you want to take for each booking. From your diary, click on Settings. In the Payments section, click Deposits and then the Add button. At the top, there is a Status drop-down menu. This allows you to disable or enable this deposit. In the description box, add a description for your deposit. This is for your reference only. There is no need to select start date and end date at this stage. Once you have entered your description, please select the promotion you wish to attach your deposit to. Take care when selecting whether you want to take deposits per cover or per booking. When adding a value, you don't need to include the pound sign. Congratulations, you have set up your deposit. Now you can test if it's working. From your diary, click on Promote. From the Promotion section, click Promotions. From the list, select the promotion you attach the deposit to and click Edit. On the info page, you should be able to see the name of the deposit in the deposit dropdown. If you're having any issues or have any questions, you can find more information about taking deposits on the knowledge base or get support anytime by raising a ticket.